A government panel has not approved a vaccine. In fact, the vaccine applications, there were two in front of two proposals in front of the government for emergency use. They've not been approved as of this moment. What we are hearing as the reason right now is lack of data on safety efficacy. Now, this is very important. Uh, unless this is done, the government cannot go ahead or the drug regulator cannot go ahead and grant authorization for these vaccines to be used, even in the case of an emergency. The government panel has, in fact, uh, said that the emergency use of these applications cannot, in fact, be done. It cannot be done till such time that there is more data. So that's the information that we have, that standard practice for the government to hold several meetings. Government does not approve these vaccines. Uh, in fact, the two vaccine candidates that were up for emergency approval were the Serum Institute of India as well as the Bharat Biotech vaccine. So both these will have to wait and provide more details to the government so that eventually at a later date when the drug controller meets, these vaccines can be approved. Sukirti now joins us with all the latest. Sukirti, uh, uh, are, we, are we to expect uh, a next round of meeting very soon? Any more details on when that is going to take place? Because uh, both these applications were on the basis of emergency use. So when are they, have they been given a time uh, when, they can, when they can come back with additional data? Uh, well, Sanket, uh, the date of the next meeting has not uh, been fixed yet, but we are expecting more details to come out from the health ministry soon. And uh, we would just like to point out uh, that this is an ongoing process. Uh, this system of approvals for emergency use authorization, several rounds of meetings are held. Decisions over vaccines uh, cannot be made over just one course of a meeting. So today they felt that they need more data. The data presented to them was not sufficient. So more data will be brought before them. And then they will be taking a decision because the subject expert committee makes recommendations on what is to be done. It cannot take a final decision on approving or rejecting something. So they will be considering all of these applications based on more data that is presented before them. As of now, the date has not been fixed, but we are expecting more details to come out from the health ministry in terms of when the next meeting is likely. So the course remains open. The path uh, for a vaccine for India remains open with a uh, both these vaccines still under consideration and uh, more data from uh, there and will be presented at the next meeting once the dates are fixed. Sukriti, when you say more data, what does this mean? Data in terms of efficacy, data in terms of the number of tests done. What exactly is this data that the government wants? Well, this, uh, you are refers to both safety data as well as efficacy data. Safety data would mean that all the participants of the trials have not shown any side effects or efficacy data would mean how effective it has proven, how many days it uh, took uh, for the antibodies to develop in one's body. So all of those aspects are questioned. Uh, and uh, these can be of uh, various uh, or maybe the uh, government uh, sometimes puts uh, conditions like, okay, if you uh, test uh, these many participants more, then you can bring the data forth to us uh, because these are ongoing trials. Uh, in both Bharat Biotech's case, uh, the phase 3 has just started uh, and in Serum Institute of India's case as well, the phase 3 is still in process. They had, however, presented uh, data of other trials as well that have been going on in UK and Brazil as well. So all of the, that data has also been presented before them and their efficacy data has also been published in the Lancet. Uh, but uh, it seems that uh, specifically with the, the India trial, there could have been certain aspects over which the committee has questions. Sure. So they have sought more data regarding that. So uh, all of uh, the safety and efficacy data will be under consideration in the upcoming days sure. as well. Sukirti, so, many thanks for joining us uh, with all the latest. Though, uh, So these vaccine candidates are still in the running uh, and uh, they'll have to come back with more data. But